Hey friends, it's the last day of our 21 days of prayer and fasting. A big thank you to each of you who have participated. Today's topic is our Rev City worship team. When reading the book of Revelation, we can get a glimpse of heaven. And that glimpse reveals that worship and praise is continually being expressed to God in Revelation. John records, After this I saw a vast crowd from every nation and tribe and people and language standing in front of the throne and before the Lamb. And they were shouting with a great roar, Salvation comes from our God who sits on the throne and from the Lamb. Amen. Blessing and glory and wisdom and thanksgiving and honor and strength belong to our God forever and ever. Amen. We are created and wired by God to worship Him. The lesser worships the greater. This is the goal of our Rev City worship team, to lead us into a place of worship, welcoming God's presence. It is when we are in that place of worship that our problems become small, our fears dissipate, and our love for God is renewed. Our hearts are healed and our hope is refreshed. I am so thankful for our worship team and their heart of worship. Worship has the power to transform us. Let me say that again. Worship has the power to transform us. This is why our worship team is focused on leading us to worship God and enter into His presence. For each of them, it is a personal goal as well. John chapter 4 says, The Father is looking for those who will worship Him. So, in 2024, let's determine to worship God no matter what the circumstances, good, mundane, or bad. The more you worship, the more your faith will grow. Let's pray. Lord, we pray for an increase of your anointing on our worship team so that they can lead us into your presence. We pray that you will give them new songs and new ways to worship you. May there be a spirit of unity and love among all the team members. May each worship team member experience ongoing spiritual renewal in their lives. And lastly, May they be an inspiration to all of us to daily cultivate a heart of worship. Amen.